Hello and welcome back to the 22nd episode of a nostalgia playthrough of Close Combat 3, Cross of Iron, Grand Campaign with the Germans on Elite Difficulty. We're keeping on advancing here. And uh, we're moving on to this uh, hillside map next, which should be fairly straightforward if we just bring the right equipment for it. And the right equipment, I'm thinking, is a Tiger Tank. Oh, we can't get more Tiger Tanks, unfortunately. Well, that's inconvenient. Let's see what else we could get, though. Um, we have 172 um, point cells, so that's pretty nice. This heavy assault gun, 150 millimeter. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Both these seem to have uh, the same gun: heavy assault gun and. Uh, Heavy infantry gun. I guess this is uh, that much cheaper due to this actually being like an SPG, the Bison. And it has an open top, so it's very susceptible to mortar fire. Which is not what we want. Uh, we're going to see if we can refit this though. Let's just get another Panzer 4G. Oh, we can get a Command t uh, Tiger. Let's do it. Now uh, we could get these 88 cells as well, but uh, whatever. Instead of those stationary 88s, which aren't going to be that useful anyway when we're on the advancer, we now have uh, two mobile 88s on the Tigers that we have. So it's starting to get uh, get quite the forcer, I would say. Um, yeah, I'll just rest this heavy machine gun team. There's no point really bringing that since they don't have a machine gun. I mean, it could be, but really, there isn't going to be. I would be surprised if we would need them to win this. Uh, that being said, once again, we have a hill here, and uh, we don't have the 88 uh, just guns right now. We have them on the armored platform of the Tiger. So they can withstand a bit more. So we're just going to put these guys up on the hill here and kind of be ready to uh, take on whatever might appear. And if nothing appears, we can start moving in with them. We'll also put the uh, Stu-42 up here, as it has a machine gun, so it could be useful just if we see any infantry. And we can put this guy over on this hill here. We are having... well, we're keeping up the pressure on the Germans. Uh, no, sorry, on the Russians, I mean. So, uh, yeah, it's, it should be fine to do this. Let's put a heavy machine gun team there. We can probably also put one on this hill. It will then be not able to fire at anything too effectively uh, from this position. It might be, but uh, it's not going to be very useful, whatever, though. We have a heavy infantry. We'll stick it in here. This heavy infantry will stick it here and just run them straight down to this building. Engineers, keep them here for these three buildings. We have some infantry in. I just hit the right button, there we go, defend, and I think that's uh, everything. Yeah, let's start. Okay, uh, so the enemy does have quite a few tanks there. Which ones can we prioritize? Let's turn us two around, focus the KV-1. Oh crap, um, smoke here, we, we might lose our Stug-3 right now. Due to this KV-1S being in front of the KV-1S, the sound the ones that are the worst to deal with, but... Yeah, they don't have, like, the best armor in the whole wide world. And we have immobilized it. Okay, so the Stug might actually be able to do something. It's got high-explosive anti-tank shells, so... If we're lucky, we don't lose the Stug, and it actually takes that out. Not sure why half the infantry have decided to be outside the house. They really... They really drop the ball on these things as they progress through the maps. Okay, okay, they're abandoning the tank. Fantastic. Uh, okay, there's an SU-122 over there. Um, they seemingly have abandoned the uh, flame tank to T-34 as well. Uh, can we even engage this? Can we even do anything to it? Not much. Uh, we're gonna just move the Tigers in. We'll keep the tank destroyer here in the back si backhand side for support. And we hope 
open play that uh, that this SU does not take out our stug. So if we can just put some smoke shells in front of it so it can't see what it's shooting at, that could be beneficial. Wait a minute, it's turning now. That's not so good. Let's put this guy in the fend. Uh, I hope it's not turning towards the Tigers, which are taking routes that I'm not on board with. We don't need to scrape up this infantry, it's fine. Okay, they surrendered. We really need to worry too much about Okay, they decided to run away. Fantastic. We had one armor damage, there was a Stug 3, and that was all the casualties that we had on this one. We destroyed a tank, captured two, destroyed a vehicle, killed seven, wounded seven, took three prisoners. So... A good result, and uh, we will just keep steamrolling the enemy most likely, hopefully, in the next map. So, you can catch me on that one. If you did like the video, I'd appreciate if you would leave a like on it, and or maybe even consider subscribing. Up to you though, no pressure. And with that, I bid you farewell. Have a good one.